Good morning and good evening if you are on the other side of the world. Ngayon, maga may tawag. May problema daw sa sewage plant. So, puntahan natin. Medyo malamig ngayon dahil negative minus uh, I think around minus 3 degree ito ngayon sa Netherland. So, kaya balot na balot. Okay, dali natin yung tools natin. Ito, yung tools ko. And let's go. Mechanic working on a sewage plant told me that automatic discharge pump is not working. Schematic diagram is our best friend in troubleshooting. Here you will immediately see the relay, contactors, and level switches responsible for turning on and off of the motor. Here let us observe contactor K3 and K4. Based on our motor behavior, I already suspect that we have problem on our low level switch LS2. As you can see here, LS2 is responsible for our cut off and LS1 for cut in. So let us check the contact between LS2. We will uh, measure it live but first we check the tester and then put it to voltmeter. Now let us check the contact. So the reading is 234 volts. That means low level switch LS2 is open contact. Here we will use our multimeter set as ammeter to bypass the low level switch and let us observe what will happen. As you can see K3 and K4 is stable. So that means we have problem with our LS2. So we turn off our sewage plant in order for us to measure the continuity of our level switches and cleaning it. With the help of our two watermen, we remove the low level switch and cleaning it. Thank you to Mr. J and Mr. Dennis. Here you can see that the level switch was really bad condition. We we'll already put it back and next is the high level switch and a high high level alarm. Here I will show it to you. How is it connected? There are two contacts in our level switch. It is normally closed and normally open. High level alarm or high level switch is connected and normally open when there is no water in the tank. Now we are cleaning also the high level switch. Again, thank you to our handsome motorman, Mr. J and Mr. Dennis. So now we will put it back, the high level switch. And next is the uh, high high level alarm switch now we are finished with the cleaning we are now running the pump in automatic mode as you can see k3 and k4 is now stable that means our system is okay and back to normal and now here you have a green indicator Automatic mode, pump one is running, no alarm. Thank you for watching. Mabuhay.